All right, so for a moment, I shall speak. If you do not want me, want to hear me speak, there will be a little time down in the underbar for when I actually start uh, putting up the matches and whatnot. So if you, you're not interested, like I said in that, um, go there. Just go down there and click on it, skip all this shit. Uh, what I'm going to talk about is some bad news for fighting game fans. Well, maybe not bad news, but bad news. Like, kind of just, whatever, it's news. Um, <laughs> shut up. Bad news number one has to do with Street Fighter Third Strike Online. Um, the patch. The patch came out for the PS3 yesterday. Actually, it was really, like, almost two days ago. Because it came out, like, almost at midnight on Tuesday. So, anyway. Um, the, the patch came out, but it did not come out for the 360. I don't know why. I don't want to get into it. I don't know if it's because of the whole Microsoft's approval process. Who knows? I don't care. Um, but then... So, it doesn't come out for the 360 for another one or two weeks. But then, going to bad news 1.5, from all the PS3 players that have actually played it and, like, you know, experienced it and whatnot, they've said, I mean, I've heard one person, only two people have specifically mentioned ranked thus far. One said it works a lot better for them and they're actually getting matches, but the connections are ass. Which, I mean, I don't even, that's probably just their connection, so can't really get into that. Because, I mean, like, all the, PS3 people have said, like, I never see green connections, which is weird. I'm, but all of them are like, I, better, I almost never see green connections. I see a lot of them, so I don't know what's going on there. Um, but the other person said ranked is still the same, and player matches have actually gotten worse. And then there are a few other people that have said, you know, like, they're getting kicked from lobbies even more often now. Lobbies are still all kinds of fucked, um, etc., etc. They didn't actually fix anything. And then... The reports for the disconnect percentage is that it's actually worse. I mean, this is just my opinion here that it's actually worse. Um, that the disconnect percentages have technically been fixed to the point where you know you're not seeing thousands or trillions or you know absurd numbers anymore. But people have have been saying you know like oh I had this disconnect percentage before, but now I don't have you know like four trillion, but I do have like a 16% disconnect right now or a 9% disconnect rate or whatever. That they have, like, actual disconnect percent rates now, even though they've never disconnected. That's worse to me. Because most intelligent people would see, you know, a 4 trillion or a 13,000 or whatever disconnect rate and be like, oh, well, that's not right. I mean, obviously, that's a bug and you can just stay in here. But then they see 16% or they see 9%. They're like, oh, fuck this guy. This guy's disconnected all over the place. Kick him out of here. So it's actually worse to me because of that. Because it actually looks like a legitimate disconnect percent rate. So that sucks, dick. Um, other than that, I mean, it's just, it sucks that, like, they... I don't know. It just sucks that they basically released a game half-finished. I mean, it really does feel like it's half-finished. Xbox, the 360's replay feature, it still doesn't even work. <laughs> it still always just says you cannot connect to the... Can, or third strike cannot connect to the online replay servers right now or whatever the fuck it says it always says that so we don't even have that shit working yet so um i don't know man just that's they released a half finished game and they're getting blasted for it um which i mean it sucks but what are you gonna do i mean it's your own damn fault you released a half finished game so sucks but that's life um so then, bad news number two is King of Fighters 13. Those of you that didn't pay attention to it, it got delayed by a month. Now, normally, you know, just a little delay, not a big deal. It's just, you know, it got delayed. They need more time to fix, you know, they need more time to fix something, whatever. But this time, the delay is actually probably going to potentially kill the game. It may kill the game because... Uh, when it was being released, like late October, the only games being released around it were Batman Arkham City and Battlefield 3. Those were the only two. There were no other fighting games being released around it. And to be perfectly honest, I don't think either of those games would have a very big impact on King of Fighters 13. I don't think they would. But now that it's been pushed back by a month, instead of just contending with those two, now it's going to be buried amidst Modern Warfare 3, Elder Scrolls V Skyrim, Assassin's Creed Revelations, Saints Row the Third, and then the two big ones that'll 
truly, I believe, kill this game. Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 and Tekken Hybrid. Because those are fighting games. It now has competition from other fighting games. More popular fighting games. Because, I mean, there were there are a lot of people out there like me whose first legitimate fighting game experience came from Street Fighter 4. That's the reason they're into the genre now, is Street Fighter 4. And so after that time of Street Fighter 4, they were just trying to pick up each and every single fighting game they could possibly get their hands on to get more experience out of it, to play more of it. And one of those games that came out around that time was King of Fighters 12. For those of you that did not play King of Fighters 12, that don't know about King of Fighters 12, it was a piece of shit. The online was one of the worst onlines you could ever imagine. Um, I mean, just imagine like the worst connection you've seen me play on Marvel. The worst connection you've seen me play on Marvel. And that was your average everyday connection on King of Fighters 12 online. It was horrible. It was just a bad game. And they knew it. Like, they just ignored the fact that, like, they ever released it. They just went into, like, complete silence after they released that game. They knew it. And so now there's a lot of people like, oh, King of Fighters 13 is coming out among all those games. Well, shit, man, I tried out King of Fighters 12, and that game was a piece of ass. I don't even care about that game. Screw it. Who gives a damn? So, uh, yeah. That sucks for them. Um, I mean, especially because, like, if I didn't have it already pre-ordered and paid off, and for the fact that you get a soundtrack with it, I probably wouldn't get it. To be perfectly honest, like, I'd wait for a while. I might even pick it up used. I don't know. I mean, like, that's what my mindset would be if I didn't already have it, like, already set and ready to go. Because I'm probably going to get Revelations. I am definitely going to get Saints Row. I am definitely going to get Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Not gonna get Tekken. I mean, that's just nothing against Tekken. It's just not my, not my, not my deal. Not my, not my thing. And I may get Skyrim. I may get Assassin's Creed. I'll probably Assassin's Creed is pretty high up there. That I'll probably get it just because I mean I have I played all the rest. I enjoyed all the rest. Why not? And I may even end up getting Modern Warfare 3, just due to the fact that, like, that may actually help me in terms of YouTube ness. Because, let's be honest, shooters are the most popular genre of games around. They are. That's just how it is. And I know, like, quite a few of you probably would not watch any of, you know, modern, any modern Warfare 3 footage. Just like, you know, a lot of you don't even watch Street Fighter, don't watch the Street Fighter videos, or you don't watch the Marvel videos, or you don't watch the Blaze Blue videos. You know, you're here for one specific reason. But the fact of the matter is, if I want a chance of turning this into something, shooters may be my way there. Because that's the focus. That's the they're po they're the popular thing. You know, you got Call of Duty. Every single time a Call of Duty comes out, it comes out and shatters previous sales records. Every single time. So like, I don't. I mean, you know, it's just it's a horrible, horrible release date for them. It's a bad idea, and it may kill the game. And I will be sad for them if it kills the game. But it's their own damn fault. You know, they picked a horrible goddamn release date, and. They just may have, you know, put the death blow on King of Fighters 13 right there. Who knows? But, uh, I hope it doesn't. But, logically, I don't really see any reason why it wouldn't. Because I know for a fact, like, I may get King of Fighters, but I'll probably be so absorbed in Ultimate Marvel by then that I won't even play that game for a while. So, who knows? Anyway, I've rambled on long enough about that. So, bad, well, maybe bad, maybe, this is a maybe, maybe bad news number three. Um... Blaze Blue Continuum Shift Extend. I was actually seeing some gameplay of Relius, and I was liking what I was seeing, and who knows, like, he may have drawn me back into Blaze Blue. Right now, there's really... I don't know. I mean, he may have gotten me back into it. Who knows? I may have ended up playing him. He may have just gotten me back into it, and then I learned another character that I wanted to play. Who knows? But, this story came out on SiliconERA.com yesterday, and the title, now here's here's why it's maybe. The title says, Sorry Blaze Blue fans, Continuum Shift Extend will not be released as a DLC upgrade. That's the title. So you just read the title alone, and you're like, well, shit. I mean, for me especially, where I'm like, I'm apprehensive about it. Like, maybe Relius is going to bring me back into it, but that's like, what, a $5? Or what, how much was it? Like, $7, $8? That's 
That was like an $8 investment, potentially, to try them out, see if I like them. And if I do, then I keep playing. If I don't, then hey, you know, it's 8 bucks. I'm, I miss out on a lunch at some point in time. <laughs> but if it's a disc release and it's like $40, I'm not going to go out and buy that when I don't know about it. Fuck that. So, but then, I actually read the story, and it says, the very first paragraph, if you want to play Blaze Blue Continuum Shift Extend, or any Blaze Blue for that matter, on PlayStation Vita, you have to buy the game on a Vita cart. Arc System Works already released, blah 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 blah. They only specifically mention the physical disc release on a Vita. They don't actually like specifically mention, they kind of dance around the 360 and PS3. They don't specifically mention, then they go on with the next thing is the ants, oh, oh, Arc System Works already released. Um, Blaze Blue Continuum Shift for PS3 and 360. So will you be able, be able to upgrade? The answer from Blaze Blue Series producer Tosumi, Toshimichi Mori, I probably said that wrong, whatever, is no. You won't be able to purchase downloadable content to turn Continuum Shift to continue, into Continuum Shift Extend. Now, that seems kind of final, right? But they never specifically mention the PS3 and the 360. So it's very confusing to me. I don't really, I don't it's not very definitive on whether or not that's actually how it's going to go down, so I don't know. But if it is a physical disc release, unlikely that I'm going to get it. I'm just, that's not going to happen. I'm not going to spend $40. Or even, I mean, like, if they release it as a $60 game, then that's definitely not going to happen. $40, very highly unlikely. It's just, but, um, yeah, so I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen there. But, uh, hopefully it's not, because I think that's just be, that would just be a bad decision. It should be the same exact way they did Platinum in BBCS2. That's the most logical thing. I mean, when you're releasing, I mean, yes, you can say, you know, like, oh, but now all the characters are on the disc. Well, yeah, but we've already, we may have already had all these characters. Like, I've downloaded every downloadable character except for Makoto. So, like, basically, I'm spending $40 for Makoto and Relius and some gameplay changes. Um, no. Absolutely not. <laughs> like, I don't want to do that. It just does not seem like a very good idea um, to release this as a disc. So who knows? So there's there's all Nate's bad... Oh, the other bad news. Bad news number four is that I may already be done with Marvel. <laughs> well, no, it's not may. I am done already with Marvel. I've played some upwards of 25, 30 games of Marvel since coming back. I have had one. One game that did not have noticeable game stuttering at times lag. Not one. So, and I mean like, I know it's not my connection because I've tried ranked, I've tried player matches, I joined at least eight or nine different various rooms that all said five bar connections and played each person in there to see, you know, like, if their connections are better or not. And you know what the sad thing was? The best connection I had in the player match room still wasn't great, but it was better than the rest, was with somebody whose card said they were Canadian. Fucking figure that one out. But, uh, so, I don't know. Um, I mean, Marvel, I'm just gonna have to train mode it up a little bit. Not a little bit, a lot, if I actually want to learn Spencer. If I actually want to learn the characters, I need to learn, because I'm planning on switching up my entire team for Ultimate so, there's all the bad news. Sorry that went on for so damn long. Um, but yeah, so hope you enjoy the matches that are going to come up. Because they may be the final Marvel matches. Potentially. So yeah, there's all the bad news. <laughs> there's nothing happy in my world. Not even my voice, because it just cracked like crazy when I tried to do that voice. <sighs> well, that seems like a good note to end on. Peace out. Shit, I can already see it kind of... Stuttering. Shit. Is this is this dude really? Is this dude legit? I've no idea why that hit me. Nice low attack from across the screen. So, such a horrible goddamn connection. Oh, I hit both of them. God damn it. Oh, what the? God 
damn it, no DHC came out. Fuck that. That should that would have hit him too. Such a bad connection. I got this. See, I told you I had it. I fucked that combo up so bad. Such a bad connection. Holy shit. All right. Those now. So, like, how the fuck? Who's gonna pay attention to that shit? Oh, that was a completely wrong goddamn assist. Fuck, this. This connection's shit, too. Is this a killer? No. That's right. Did he just use. You just use a team hyper combo! What is wrong with you? Ah, no dash. What am I doing? That was completely wrong combo. What? That's what I was mashing. Fuck you, dog. Hey, he charged for too long, didn't even come out. Man, okay, screw you charging. <laughs> Go ahead, charge that shit. I don't give a damn. Damn, not high enough. That's right, I don't give a damn about your X Factor. Oh, wait, I forgot. This is what I do now for X Factor. Whee! I don't even care. Oh shit. That was, yeah, I forgot. I completely forgot that shit has ridiculous invincibility. Nope. Shit. Oh, that punished me. How saddening. It's okay. I have no faith in his execution. Come here. Come here! There we go. There he is. Boom! <laughs> oh, man. So these connections are both ass. That sucks. But yeah, so King of Fighters, that delay is gonna kill it. I don't know what the, I don't know why they needed the delay. I don't know if it's like they didn't finish the character they were planning on. I don't know why. But that shit is now in, like, the worst possible window. It's in the worst possible window now. It's horrible. That's a horrible window for it to, um... For it to be released in. Alright, I'm gonna use... I'm gonna use zero. I'm feeling... I need to... I, I still haven't hit up training mode. I mean, like, I'm a little bit better. I know, you know, like, I know his overhead now. I know how to maneuver in the air now. I know all that shit. But... I don't even know how to do his armor piercer. What am I doing? Why am I not learning? Shit. Oh, that's the other bad news was the fact that, oh, this dude, is this dude gonna try to show me what's up? Is he gonna try to show me what's up? Why are you using Amaterasu as an anchor? It's a horrible idea. Amaterasu is a horrible anchor. Are ya? I bet I'm better. See, you're walking backwards. That's already, that's already. Told you, dog. Told you, dog. Can't handle my mix-up, son. Shit. That's fine. Oh, wow, okay. That's not fine. That's fine. He's gonna drop it. Oh, I didn't think I was gonna hit. That's not even gonna hit me, is it? Oh, it did. How stupid. What a stupid character. Um, alright. Well, I just lost a character due to, uh... Okay, I didn't. Okay, I did. I just lost a character due to bullshit. I have no idea why that hit me. 
That was a bad idea, actually. Oh, never mind, no, it wasn't. I thought he was going to be able to air dash. That sucks. I mean, like, all the hits he got, I shouldn't have gotten hit by. So that's, you know, welcome back to online Marvel. That's the other bad news, is I'm already, I think I'm already done with Marvel again online. Because, like, I've played upwards of 25, 30 games. Now, since coming back, I've tried, I've tried ranked. I've tried... Um, I've tried ranked, I've tried fucking, what am I trying to say, I've tried like tons of various player matches, I've tried like everything possible and I just, I've had one good connection. I mean like, and by good I mean one connection that did not have noticeable like stuttering lag. Just one. Only one. So... And that was a rank match, so I didn't get to, you know, stick around and keep playing. And I have not had a good player match. Oh, I didn't think that would go through. Oh my god, yeah, this is quality. Hey, thanks, Kuma. There it is. Don't be predictable, Sonny! Shit, that's right, my bad. I forgot that misses there. Jesus Christ, turn your mic off, bro. Oh, so late. Drill. <laughs> Damn it, that was supposed to be an air throw. Really? 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 Nice combo? Oh my god, that worked. What a stupid character, huh? Overhead, yes, that's what I wanted. Go ahead, do it. Should have done Tatsu first, but whatever. <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> well, that sucks, dick. Why did that miss? That makes no goddamn sense! Why did that shit miss? Oh, if I lose now, I'm gonna be so sad. Yeah, I was... That super jump killed that. Peace out. What?! Motherfucker, what?! Well, that sucks. Well, he has no meter, so I guess it doesn't. Do it again. Do it again. I can't believe that miss. Why did that miss? Oh. But still, why did that miss? Maybe I should have done... Hmm. I'm not sure why that missed. I'm going to have to try. The grapple, I guess? Hmm. I'm very, very confused why exactly that missed. Alright, well. Shit happens, I guess. I'm gonna do one more. And I'm gonna use Hulk, Sentinel Phoenix, and then I'm gonna be done. Because I'm, yeah. All these connect. None of these connections are all really good. So I'm gonna just use Hulk, Sentinel Phoenix. Do one last troll. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah! Boom. Um, yeah, so... 
That's all my bad news. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep playing this game. To be really honest. Oh, I'm going to Starbase tonight, though. I'm going to Starbase. So watch that. I'll probably already have left by the time this gets uploaded. But so, uh, you know, check that shit out. Check out the stream. If I get there in one piece, I might not. That was supposed to be a... Joke's on you so hard. <laughs> that was uh, that was supposed to be a command grab. It wasn't. Oh come on! Actually, I guess my heavy came out first. No dive kicks for you, SA. Nothing really. Maybe he was already in the air. I don't know. Too early. No, too late. <laughs> That's fine, though. I don't mind. I have Phoenix, yo. No, you don't. That kind of sucks, because now I can't punish it. Alrighty, so that's going to be that for Marvel. Who knows if I'm going to be back? Um, I don't, because honestly, I mean, the connections, like I said, they're just, they're not any good. I am not, I'm just not having any fun with it, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, at the very least, I've, like, I've shaken off the rustiness, at least, you know what I mean? Like, I've kind of, as you can see, I was actually doing, like, legit Akuma combos, um, and that's, so, I mean, that the good thing is that I have, um... This is where I need to be. 